Michael Pineda of the Duncan Banner here with Kevin Kelly of the Kevin Kelly Wrestling Show. <laughs> Today we have an exciting show planned for you. Kevin Kelly is in his classroom clothes. That's right. And we have, once again, a what new addition to the wrestling room. Tom Brack, eat your heart out. <laughs> a brand new computer. Tell us about your new computer, Coach. <laughs> oh, well, uh, the one that we added here was, it was a nice one. You know, it took forever. Couldn't, uh, you know, you could push some buttons and wait on stuff to download. Shoot, I could go mop the mats and come back <laughs> and, <laughs> and it'd be ready. So, uh, but yeah, they got uh, me, the uh, two basketball coaches, and uh, somebody else a new computer. All right. It makes it nice. I bet it does. Well, I had a big week last week. Kind of locked in your next trip to Still State. Yep. Tell me a little bit about that if you'd be so kind. Well, we uh, thought it was the best we've wrestled all year. We uh, we beat uh, Ardmore Durant and Lawton Mack and uh, you know, beat, them, beat them, you know, pretty convincing. You know, and uh, like I said, I thought uh, a lot of our kids, you know, really stepped up. We kind of fed off each other. You know, we got on a, we got on a good road at one point and pinned nine straight kids. Wow. You know. And anytime, anytime you can do that in high school, you know, you know, you know it's, it's good. Okay. And that qualifies you for Dual State, which will be where and when? It's um, February the uh, 12th and 13th at Sky Took. Where's Sky Took? About 20, mile, 20 miles north of Tulsa. I know that makes me sound like culture why I say that because there's probably people in Sky Took go where's the duck is. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> Yeah, um, it's a long ways up there. Well, it is. Um, when do you get the seating for that? We'll get it the uh, the Monday of Dual State. So wow, it comes out like the seventh. Well, I guess that equals procrastination. That's mm -hmm. not like then. Oh yeah, yeah. So you know, we could we could wind up the number two, three, or four seat out of the West. It just kind of depends on a lot of it. Might depend on this weekend on how we do it at uh, at the Chick Shack tournament. Okay, and at the Ching Shake Tournament, I guess it'll be kind of like Carl Albert in the fact most of the Midwest region people will be there. Um, some of them will. Like, uh, well, at Dual State, Altus is pretty much sewn up more right. than one seat out of the West. And two, three, and four is going to be between us, Carl Albert, and Deer Creek. And uh, we don't wrestle any of them head up. Yeah. And uh, so it goes on it goes on your tournament placings in January. <clears throat> well, at the Carl Albert Tournament, we placed ahead of, ahead of Deer Creek pretty mm -hmm. good. And Carl Albert beat us by four points, I think. But okay. we didn't. We didn't have Justin Hughes or Jeff Irvin. So, and both of those are us and Carl Albert and Deer Creek are going to be at the Chick Shack tournament this weekend too. So it could come down to how we place at the Chick Shack tournament on how we get seated. And you expect to be healthy this week? I hope so. Justin Hughes went uh, Friday to the doctor and took uh, some more chest chest X rays, and he should know. He's supposed to know today whether he can. Uh, he's clear to start wrestling again so okay and we also have some action tomorrow night tuesday what's well, uh, the junior high <coughs> yeah tomorrow night the uh, junior high wrestles a lot mac a lot mac and then thursday thursday we wrestle our junior high and high school wrestles chick shake at chick shake okay well tuesday you know right now i don't know many people that want some of the junior high I'm telling you man our, our junior high is, is, is tough it's real tough and we uh, been to two uh, two tournaments and won both tournaments. Won this weekend. Uh, Cody Merrill got an outstanding wrestler this weekend at the tournament. He uh, kid that he pinned in the finals uh, was outstanding wrestler of the El Reno Junior High tournament. And uh, you know John Strickland is helping out with our uh, our junior high team. Uh -huh. You know he's been you know he's been around wrestling forever. You know and he uh, he's done our you know he's done junior highs. You know, he's been an act active in the junior high program for a long time, and he was head high school coach, you know, here for quite a while. And he told us not to, uh, about two or three weeks ago, he said he thinks this is the best junior high team he's ever seen. That does. All so right. Yeah. So uh, it's kind of, you know, looks good for the future. You know, if we can keep them all, keep them all healthy and together, and keep getting better, you know, we're gonna be, we're gonna be tough. I don't know what to say. I'm speechless at this point. <laughs> yeah. Well, Coach, we appreciate you. Go out there, pull out the fire, kick the tires. Do what you got to do, man. You bet. Sounds All right. Good. We'll talk to you later. All right, thanks.